at the end of this video you must be aware or you must have the knowledge in terms of how do you find the missing terms of an arithmetic progression okay so uh, you have been given an arithmetic progression where there are five terms one two three four five the first term let's call this as a is equal to 12 right this is the first term. What we also know is that the fifth term, okay, because if you count 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, the fifth term is equal to 28, right? We need to find out the value of the second, third, and the fourth term, right? Now, we know the value of an nth term of an AP is equal to A, plus n minus 1 times the difference where a is the first term so in order to find out the second third and fourth value we need to know the first term which in our case is clear 12 right plus n minus 1 now what is n n refers to the number of term so if this is the second term the value of n is equal to 2 minus 1 right if it is the third term, instead of n, we put in 3, minus 1. For the fourth term, we put in 4, minus 1. But what we don't know is the value of this difference. So how do I find this out? The answer is simple. For the fifth term, the value is given to you as 28. But this 28 should be equal to a plus n minus 1 times t. Or in other words, a is what? 12 plus n is what 5 5 minus 1 4 times d should be equal to 28 because this is the value that has been given to you or 4d is equal to 28 minus 12 which is 16 which gives us a value of d as 4 which is 16 by 4 once i know the value of d i just need to plug it in the second third and fourth term at the respective places right I'm sure you guys will be able to solve this out. I'm just going to write the answers. 2 minus 1, 1. 1 times 4, 4. 4 plus 12 gives you 16. So the second term is 16. The third term is going to be 20. 3 minus 1, 2. 2 times 4, 8. 8 plus 12, 20. Similarly, this is going to be equal to 24. And that is how you find out the missing terms of an arithmetic progression because to find these missing terms, what we need to know is the first term and the common difference. Once we know the common difference, it's easy.